Hey everybody, welcome back to more Pokemon Mystery Dungeon Red Rescue Team. I'm your host, Blue Yash Bullseye, and in the last part, we made it here to the midsection of Sky Tower. In this part, we're going to confront Rayquaza, tell him what's going on with the world, and have him stop the meteor. Now, this part may seem odd to you because it is post commentated. There was a massive mess up with my recording. I still have all the game footage and the second part of this episode is back to normal. It'll be live commentary. It'll be perfectly fine. But right now, right now for like the next 17 minutes, about, it's going to be crap. I've seen this little part right here like s five times already just trying to f do the post comms here I keep getting distracted but I th it was at this point where I immediately ugh, immediately thought it was screwed and I'm gonna have to restart but I don't because otherwise you wouldn't be seeing this and actually this is this Wait, one has been my best best run of this dungeon ever. And I, I'm looking at the Aerodactyl there and looking at how fuzzy it gets. It's just to say, I used my last Reviver Seed right there on the, from that Aerodactyl. And yeah, I'm, I'm really sorry. I have no clue what happened with the recording. I've recorded way longer parts than this in the past. And nothing's gone wrong like this. And I had nothing really open. So I have no clue. And what's even worse about this is later on in the video, not too much longer even, the game audio gets so desynced. I have no clue what happened. I severely apologize in advance, but I have. I don't know. It's just insane. Crappy insane, too. And it had to happen on the finale, too. That's the worst part. Like, like here, I notice, like last time I, uh, like last time I was trying to, pr like, do the commentary, it was like, wait, this seems like it's going faster. Like it's going slightly faster. And I will. Well, may not at this point, but in a moment. And then. Yeah, like, see, it's. The game audio is perfect right now. But in a moment. I still. There's the ember and how it should be, but. I actually think. The game at completely skips a floor, if I'm not mistaken, in this. And I can't remember. But, yeah. This, let me just try to do what I did in the library. Right? This dungeon is really jerkish. If you've, I've already done a few of these floors, but you see these floors, like how I'm on right now. It's got three rooms at the top, three rooms on the bottom, and two on each side. So ten rooms in total. You don't know which room the stairs in, so you actually kind of have to go around in a circle until you find it. At least that's what I do. They had this dungeon in the next, this type of dungeon in the next game, but it was it wasn't the last dungeon, so it wasn't as hard. Even though there were ghost types and everything, they if there was no walls, so you could hit them while they were completely away from you. I if the Wii U has the DS DS game compatibility, I probably will do that game later on in the later on in my career. Let's play career, whatever you want to call it, hobby. I don't know. <sighs> but this. This is just annoying right now. I really don't want to post commentate again. Right here. This is where. See? See what the hell's going on right here? It's completely screwing up. 
and I noticed that immediately. I'm looking at the floor number right now. It's at six floors. And okay, right there, Metagross. We just saw him. I'm gonna say what I said in the live thing. He does not belong here. He does not have wings. He does not have the ability to levitate. He does not belong here at all. See, I just used the Thunder Shock right there in the game audio. When did I use Thunder Shock? I don't know. But seventh floor. I think we completely skipped the eighth floor in this dungeon, if I'm not mistaken. Which I have no clue how that happened. I have no clue why that happened. But unfortunately, it. I think it happened. Like, okay, maybe we just go at massive mock speed. But Metagross. Metagross is. Oh, whoa. What the fuck? Whoa, whoa. Okay, no, we don't. Wait a sec. Oh. Okay, no, we don't skip the eighth floor, but here, then that staircase leads to the final f floor. <sighs> this is bad. I. If I could, I would completely re record this, but. I don't want to go through the entire game again up to this point. It's just. Yeah, so right here I'm tr I'm working with a link box to try to get Thunder Shock and Shock Wave together. So the link switch around Shock Wave and Quick Attack and link them together. Now that's what I want to do. Done with link box. Yes, I am. And ground proceed. Yeah, I don't know what's going on with the game audio right now, but I think I'm working with the link box. Who goes there? Who does? Yeah, and it's still going. I can't read. The voice could be Rayquaza. Indeed, I am. This guy's my domain. Depart at once. But we don't have time to argue. We came here because we need your help. Whenever. Okay, I'm gonna. I'm try I want to read this guy, but I got read fast. I'm the being of the sky. You are the descendants of the ground. Okay, I think it starts to slow down here. But it'll speed up back up later, I think. To each, there is a world destined to as their own. For hundreds of millions of years, never once have I descended to the ground. And the opposite sh shall also hold true. Let there be no mercy for those who defy the laws of nature. Prepare for the end. And, okay, it's speeding up again. Great. I'm really sorry for this. I did not intend for this to happen. I only want the 99 floor dungeons to ever be sped up. But luckily, those won't have commentary, so <laughs> it'll be good. Yeah, here, right in the game audio. I'm just confronting Rayquaza now. See how bad it is. But now I'm done. My shockwave ran out of PP, down to Thunder Shock. And at this point, I'm thinking, okay, um. I'm screwed right now, aren't I? It's um, it's gonna beat me because I'm pretty weak. I sh quite under level for this. I should be about level 35, but alas, I am not. S so I take off those just so Cyndaquil will use smoke screen, and it's starting to slow down here. We're getting really slow too. So it's okay. This is bad. I am sorry. Yeah, it's getting really slow. So I don't know what the hell's good. I kind of have a feeling it's going to like just whoosh back to where the game audio is. You oh, we be Rikoiza. I'm about to get it freaking interrupted. Okay, one sec. Gah! Gah. Gah! What? 
earthquake? It's not possible. We're on the top of clouds. These are shock waves. And they're huge. That's it. I got it. Look straight up, Raquaza. And in the game audio, I just beat Raquaza. Perfect. What? What is? Okay. It's a shooting star, and it's enormous. It will destroy the world if it continues on its path. That is why we came. Please, destroy the falling star. So that is why. Yes, please hurry and destroy it. Before I try, I need to know your resolve. That star has come too close. If I were to lose my hyperbeam here, you would not escape unscarthed. So, we accepted that from the start. Well said. I'm a charge in my laser. Take charge of your destiny. And I'm a fire in my laser. Wow. Is this a dream? No, this is no dream. Yes, the star's explosion swallowed me, and now I'm adrift, as a spirit. What's going to happen? The Shadow Gengar? Hehe, <laughs> Pikachu. Don't take much to put you down. Serves you right. Now, what to do with you? I know. I'll drag you into the dark world. That'll do. Gengar is dragging me. Gengar said he would drag me into the dark world. What is the dark world? Am I going to be abandoned in the world I don't know? Darn it, I took the wrong path. What? This isn't like me. Can't tell which way it is. <sighs> to heck with this. I'll just ditch you here. That's it. Goodbye to you. Hey. Hey, can you hear me? Snap out of it. Huh? This place. Uh. We're getting consciousness. Ooh. I'm sure of it. I'm sure back there Gengar saved me. Maybe did Gengar save Pikachu too? Awesome, you're alive. You really had us all worried. You were incredible. Snivel, I'm glad you're safe. It's fantastic. Everyone, thank you, but what about the star? What happened to it? Ka Wait a sec. Fear not, the star is no more, though it will not be for right away. The disaster shall soon be calmed. Okay, now the game audio is ahead a bit. We did Pikachu. Everything worked. We won the... P Wish Cash Pond. Helipers post office. Yippee! This was Grace. This calls for. Let me shoot my hydro pump to kick it off. Whoa, hold there. Don't you point those things at me. Face the other way. The other way. No, no. Let's lose it. Haha. <laughs> you gotta be kidding me. I'll secure him. You can't get away. Oh, not bad. What, you serious? No, don't! <laughs> Pikachu.
Gardevoir. We owe everything to you and your friends. Peace has returned to our world. Thank you for everything. And now, your role has ended. Soon you must return to your own world. It is time to bid farewell. It has finally come. The time has finally arrived. Pikachu, I'm sorry for this. To everyone, please bid farewell. Oh. <gasps> Pikachu, your body. What's happening to you? Cyndaquil. Everyone, I'm sorry. But I have to leave. What? But what are you saying? Everyone, thank you for everything all this time. Huh? Leave? What do you mean, leave? My role as a Pokemon has ended. I have to return to the human world. Unbelievable. Go back? To human world? Well, why? Why? I don't understand. Why do you have to leave? Didn't we... Aren't we friends? <laughs> yes, you'll always be my friend. I will never forget you. Don't go. I'm blessed to have met you. Hi. What am I going to do when you're gone? I'm sorry. This is goodbye. Pikachu. 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 No. Pikachu. This is where it's screwed up. Why? I don't understand. I just don't understand either. But the audio and everything will be fixed in just a moment. And it will be resuming live commentary. Thank you. Thank you for dealing with this, and have a good day. <laughs> Pikachu, why? I don't understand. Why? Why was it necessary to leave us? Pikachu saved my life, but I hadn't done anything to show my thanks. Left before I could even say thanks. You're right. Just up and went like that. What now? Why has the world been saved? Just when things were going to be better. Sob. This was coming. Our world, it was saved by Pikachu. I look back now. When bound for Sky, Pikachu seemed as if resigned. Resigned to accept what was to come. I think I know. Pikachu must have... He must have become a Pokemon to save us. And when, when the star was destroyed, Pikachu knew what would what be the time to leave. Why? Why didn't Pikachu tell me earlier? If I knew this was coming, why didn't Pikachu tell me? Those words couldn't be spoken. As much as you are heartbroken now, Pikachu must have felt the same pain of leaving. Try to understand. Pikachu! And my phone's ringing. But I don't care. What is this? I'm rising into the sky. Is this my spirit? I wonder where I'm going. Voices! I hear voices! I hear dead people. <laughs> Your friend is heartbroken. A true friend. A friend for life. You finally realize it now. If you wish, and wish very strongly, Perhaps 
you will meet again. And these are the credits. Koishi Nakamura. Nakamura. <laughs> well, this. Okay, where's my TV remote? The volume's getting kind of loud. <laughs> um. Okay, I I don't see it. I can stand. Oh, I'm okay. I'm stretching right now because uh, I've been sitting on my chair for a while. Uh Sorry if my cord just hit my mic, but I can't seem to see my TV remote to load it. Fine, I'll fucking do it manually. Um, channel. There. That should do it. Well, anyway. This will be attached to the last part just because it's a finale. Sort of. Just the last part, it was getting really messed up. I don't know why. I guess just the length of the recording, but... I have recorded much longer than that before. So I don't know. A anyway. So. This has been Pokemon Mystery Dungeon Red Rescue Team, the main game. Now. For the post game. There are much harder dungeons. Much harder challenges. Much stronger Pokemon. And much more fun. I hope y'all liked the main game. But I don't know what to say. It was really fun playing it. So far, best run of my the game ever. In fact, Let's Playing has made me better at some of the games. The Chrono Trigger. I feel I did a pretty good run of it for being completely blind. Well, mostly blind. The only part that wasn't blind were the side quests and the finale. Or not the finale, but the final parts. I just looked up the health of the enemy. And, oh, it appears the credits have stopped. But I don't think I still... I still think I don't need to touch it. So, I don't want to leave. I want to stay longer. With my invulnerable. Irreplaceable friend. As I was saying, like with my Let's Plays, they have been getting a mate being really good Dragon Ball Z that was my best friend in the game and I've played through it like 50 times before and Pikachu returns and everyone's speechless so end of the main game to press the button will be all the new start finger <laughs> so the story of Pikachu and Cyndaquil ends here but chaos isn't done yet there are many rescues to be done a new adventure begins the legendary Pokemon are set to make their appearance. Don't go away. Yes, I'd like to save my adventure. And that concludes the first finale of Pokemon Mystery Dungeon Red Rescue Team. I can't recall what the next fin what dungeon the next finale will be, but <sighs> I fear it. For the reason of that, I'm pretty sure the dungeon is extremely hard. And I don't want this game to end. But anyway, I will see you next time on Pokemon Mystery Dungeon Red Rescue Team.